Look, the gorgeous Jennifer Metcalf has joined us this morning. Your character, Mercedes, you took it, you've been a year off, haven't you? Yes. Uh, well, in real life, it's for maternity leave, wasn't yeah, it? To have yeah. your first one. But she is back with an absolute splash tonight on Channel 4. Mercedes in Magalu for a Hindu. What on earth could go wrong? Welcome <laughs> back. And welcome <laughs> back you. to being back on... Her. How is it? Because, I mean, I have to say, you've come back off maternity leave and your first shoot is in a bikini. I mean, all power to you, do you know what I mean? Oh, that must have been a hard thing to come back to. I didn't really care. I was just happy to be part of it all again. <laughs> Good or, like, for you. Put me in whatever. Um, it was so much fun, like, going out there with all your friends that I've not seen properly for a year. So Mercedes invited all her family and friends mm -hmm. out to Magalu for a Hindu. They don't know who she's marrying. No. And then it's revealed it's... <laughs> it's her first love. They're just like, what? I think out of everybody who they'd have put her back with, it wouldn't have been him. And is it lovely to come back into a really big storyline? I mean, there's no softly, softly to you coming back, no. is there? I mean, I wouldn't have expected it any other way. Uh, Mercedes is always, like, the heart of all the mischief and the drama. So when they said we were going to Magaluf, and she thinks she's changed, but she absolutely hasn't, as we've just all seen. Um, I, I was made up. I was made up with a story. Can I ask you, when, when you're filming someone like Magaluf, because I've only ever filmed in, like, Salford, you know, <laughs> that's what I did six months. You know, is it, is it an amazing experience? You think, oh, it's going to be great, the sun's out, or is it, is it really tough work in the end? Be honest. Be honest. Yeah, it's hard work because obviously you don't have your siestas and you don't have your beer an hour. And, right. You know what I mean? <laughs> um, it's hard. But at the same time, I think because maternity leave was so difficult. Mm. Um, your maternity leave was difficult? Yeah. Why? Because my little boy never kept still and for about six months he screamed his life away and he didn't sleep very good. So for me to be out in that setting working with all my friends mm. again, um, obviously I love my little yeah, boy yeah, and I yeah. love the time with him. Um, but it's really important to be honest about that, though, isn't yeah. it? Because I think people can make it Sugar out that maternity leave is this wonderful uh -huh. experience, and actually, it can be quite isolating and quite difficult. It can. And I was in Newcastle as well, so um, I didn't have. I had Greg and his mum and dad, who were incredible, and I made a couple of friends up there. But it wasn't like being at home. And I realised, I think, being up there, that Liverpool is my home with all my friends there and everything. I've been there twelve years, mm. um, so it is quite isolating. Are you going to move? Uh, I've been based back in Liverpool. Been based now back for two there. Months. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Qu quick question for mm -hmm. you. We've just had some news in, actually, that Katie Piper is the first contestant in Strictly oh. Come Dancing on the BBC. Now, you did Dancing on Ice, didn't yes, you? Yes, did. Would you consider Strictly? And what would be your advice to someone like Katie? I love Katie, but I think she's amazing. I think she'll so. do amazing. Yeah. I mean, oh, the nerves just got the better of me. And I was dancing on two blades, so take that out of the equation. I think you just got to enjoy it. Like, throw yourself into it, enjoy it, and know your moves, I guess. <laughs>